When you are looking for RF power products for the most demanding applications, NXP is your partner of choice. If you are tired of replacing dead RF power transistors, then make this a thing of the past with NXP's new XR, extremely rugged, LDMOS devices. So rugged are these new transistors that there is a very good claim that they are unbreakable. NXP's extreme rugged technology is a significant step forward for LDMOS in 2011. It poses the question, how rugged is extremely rugged? Well, we will show you. On the bench, we have the BLF578XR in a Class AB amplifier, delivering 1200 watts into a 50 ohm load. Now we create a very transistor-unfriendly open circuit situation by disconnecting the output load. We switch on the power and quickly short the output with a screwdriver. You can see the extreme amount of energy at the terminals, a condition that would kill most LDMOS devices. We return to the normal situation, 50 volts, 1200 watts into a 50 ohm load, and see that the amplifier still works perfectly. So far, so good. But there is more to come. The next test of ruggedness is with a controlled load mismatch through all phases, enabled by the test fixture now in view. The mismatch unit is connected to a network analyzer. And by a simple manual control, we can set it to work through all phases of the Smith chart. This mismatch unit will create voltage standing waves with ratios from 55 to 1 up to a maximum of 125 to 1. Again with the normal situation, standard 50 volts, 1200 watts into a 50 ohm load. So at this moment, the amplifier is operating at full power. The mismatch unit now replaces the dummy load connected to the output of the amplifier and the test setup is powered up again. The mismatch unit is now varied to expose the LDMOS transistor to a range of extreme mismatch conditions and positions on the Smith chart. The extreme conditions vary from VSWR from 55 to 1 to 125 to 1. Now we show the transistor is still alive by going back to the original load and showing the 1200 watt output power. And it still works. Would you ever dare treat a transistor worse than this? Well, check out the next test. Even though the transistor is normally used at 50 volts, we proceed to test at 55 volts just to challenge the extremely rugged BLF578XR. We set up the transistor at 55 volts, 1200 watts into 50 ohms. We disconnect the output load creating a very transistor-unfriendly open-circuit situation. And we power up the transistor to 1200 watts. Can we treat the transistor in an even more unfriendly manner? Look at the following. We screw the short to the output of the amplifier while the transistor is powered up. Next, we go back to the 50 ohm load and power up the transistor to 1200 watts. And we see that it again survives and works perfectly. So this is what we mean by extremely rugged. And as we have shown you, this transistor even seems to be unbreakable. What do you think? <laughs>